Ang, it's a great house. The town is very family oriented. Yeah. Uh-huh. No, I miss you. <laughs> I miss you more. I love you. Yeah, I do. I'll call you tomorrow, huh? Okay? Uh-huh, I love you. I'll call you tomorrow, baby. Bye. Oh, no, 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 no. I love you. No, 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 no. I love you. Birdman, I think I'm gonna puke. Well, I tell you what, Jeff. You wait till you meet Angela. You're gonna see what I'm talking about. She's the best. My first season in the pros, and I got to room with Howdy Doody. I'm gonna cut a lot of guys after the Washington scrimmage tomorrow. Hey, if you can't stand the heat. Bird Dodson is gone. What? Where'd you hear that? It's all over the place, man. About how you two got into it? Oh, come on. That wasn't hey. my fault. Man, so I wouldn't even worry close. about it. He should have been gone a long time ago. I hope you sleep good tonight, Bird. Yeah. Dodson got sent to Bridgeport. Farm team. Big pay cut. Got a wife, two kids. Yeah. Now, wait a second, Merce. I didn't do anything to that guy. I mean, I just played him straight up. Really? Yeah. All right, we'll see you out on the field tomorrow, Rook. Straight up. Yeah. <laughs> Don't be late. Friendly. What'd I do? Hey, man, you hung tough. He was a loser. Guy's got a wife. He's got two kids. But it's either you or him. You back down, you're gonna be the next one cut. I'm not backing down, Marvin. All right, then. It's just freshman year all over again, that's all. Mm-hmm. That was the job. Here we go, baby. Big scrimmage today. What up, Pep? Hey, Mom, how you doing? Hey, Pep. Check this dude out. He's like a wild man. He trips to heavy metal music and he prays like he's got a private line to God's ear. Hey, whatever works for you, use it. Yeah. But I want to know what he got in that little bag he's always carrying around. Hey, Bird! Bird! What's that, Mark? What's in that bag? Uh, a little of this, a little of that, so... Don't you think it's gonna help you make the team? Just mine. Then where can I get mine? <laughs> I can't tell you that, Marv. You gotta figure that one out for yourself. Uh, no messages. It's against NFL regulations. No, no, Pep. Th these aren't messages. This is this is just for me. That's all. Just for me. Got that, boy. You lost your best hunting dog or something. Hey, Murph. I keep hearing the words bird and Bridgeport. Same sentence. Farm boy on the farm team. Don't be messing with my head like that, Murph. Just telling you what we hear. All right, you guys be good now. You be good. Yes, yeah, Bird. Hi, Mike Jack from Daily News. How oh, you doing? Hi. Yeah, how, how are you? Good, good. See, I'm hearing some rumors about Bridgeport. What can you tell me about that? You're hearing rumors about Bridgeport? Yeah, yeah. I can't tell you anything about Bridgeport. Hey, don't think it's so hard, man. It happens all the time. Jeff, the press knew about it before I did, all right? You tell me, what am I going to tell my family? 
What am I gonna tell Angela? Maybe they'll bring me back up soon. You mean just? I just love these potatoes. Hey, Bert. I'm really sorry. <sighs> Look on the bright side. Bridgeport isn't that far away. You can still come on by and watch us play. Yeah. Y'all got a problem? What are you looking at? The slowest guy ever to catch on in the history of the Jets. <laughs> <laughs> there is no Bridgeport farm team. There is no farm team in Bridgeport. Well, Bert, if he was an Eskimo, we'd be selling you ice. <laughs> oh, man. Move out, guys. Move it out. Move it out. Hey, welcome to the Jets, Bert. Yeah! But blocking Braves misses him. McMillan can't get him. And Flagler carries it easily through this Jet defense. O'Brien under pressure. Laterals off to Hector. Hector can't get his hands on it. Goes after it. Kicks the ball into the sidelines. Jones headed to the end zone. Washington strips the ball. The Jets have the ball. No, Jones recovers. Touchdown, Patriots. And look at these fans making themselves pretty clear. Herman Thomas off tackle makes to the inside. Untouched. Two and nine. You know what those numbers are? Our record. I blame the defense for the miserable season we're having, especially you rookies. You're not pulling your weight. Now, we brought you into this system to be the future of this team, not its downfall. What the hell is the matter with you guys? This game is more than just rushing a passer. And if I see one more arm tackle, I'm finding the son of a bitch. Jets have been in over a thousand phone calls a day about you, Dennis. Yeah, yeah. They had to set up a special line. Everybody wants to know how the Birdman's doing. Yeah, that's right. What are you tell him. You tell him I've been much worse. You, didn't I? Man, I can't believe you said that. I was gonna say the exact same thing. I tell you, you got better. I'm so sorry, Dennis. Come on, man. This is from a buddy of mine, Airborne. Broke both of his legs on a jump. They said that he wouldn't walk, and now he does. He wanted you to have this. Will you put it in my hand, please? Yeah. It said it's a symbol for courage, bravery. Visiting hours will be over in 15 minutes. Visiting hours will be over in 15 minutes.
Want some company? Hey, Jeff. Come here where I can see you. The guys were just here, taking it real hard. It's hard to look at you, Dennis. I didn't even know if I could come here. It's okay, Jeff. It's not okay. It's definitely not okay. I mean, I'm overwhelmed here, D. You got the screws in your head, the bars, the vest. I mean, you're a football player, Dennis. You can't move. It's not supposed to end like this. It hasn't ended, Jeff. I'll get my operation tomorrow. I'll get my arms back, my legs back. It hasn't ended. See, that's my faith. Don't you go soft on me. You're starting to look like Howdy Doody or something. Man, don't you make me mad. I'm gonna go get my lug wrench and tighten them screws down on you, man. Oh, yeah? Well, I still got my right bicep, and that's all I need to kick your butt, so go bring it on, man. <laughs> Jeff, please get the nurse. What's the matter, man? I soiled myself. Will you please get the nurse. There's potential for recovery, but it may be years before we know how complete a recovery it will be. After an extensive search, it's been decided he'll do his rehab here with Dr. Christian Ragnarsson, director of the Mount Sinai Hospital Department of Rehabilitation. Doctor? Thank you. Uh, Dennis has had the finest surgical team in the country, Atlantic Hill. Now he'll be moving here to Mount Sinai for a program of rehabilitation. Rehabilitation will be slow and progress incremental. We simply can't say what physical capabilities, if any, Dennis will regain. So, we've got a football. Lawrence, this is football, not soccer. I know, I know, I know. Well, you didn't grow up with football players. In high school, college, these guys, they got away with murder. All because they play a game. You know, you exaggerate. You'll see. <laughs> Excuse me. Coming through. Excuse me. Excuse me. Coming through. Hello? Excuse me. Dennis, I'm Joanne Giametta. This is Lawrence Harding. We're going to be your rehab therapists. Oh, it's a pleasure to meet you, Miss Gio. Giametta. <laughs> Giametta. My ancestors, they go all the way back to Queens. <laughs> all right, listen up. I need to speak to Dennis and his wife alone, please. Uh, Thank uh, you. Yes, ma'am. Let's go. 